The Microprojector X1000 is a very stable technology that has been available for many years. Uniquely, it will project a microscopic image either vertically on a table or horizontally on a white projector screen. To begin, you will need to plug the microprojector into a power outlet. Once you have plugged it in, you may now turn the switch to the on position on the microprojector. You will notice in the head of the microprojector the light source should be on. The microprojector works like a traditional compound microscope except that it's inverted. At the very top you'll have your light source. Then you will have your stage with your stage clips to put your slide on. You also have a revolving polarizer analyzer. You have the objective lenses. You have focusing knobs and then finally a mirror that you can use or decide to not use by moving it out of the light sources path. For table projection, be sure to place a white sheet of paper between the legs of the base. Make sure the mirror is out of the way of the light beam coming straight through the stage and going to the table surface. Once you are ready, place the specimen slide on the stage and hold in place with the stage clips. Use the large focusing knob to focus your slide onto the desktop. First, you'll want to lower the stage to the lowest position and then reverse direction until the specimen is brought into focus. To gain an additional five times magnification, rotate the revolving dustproof disc until the red A is present. The microprojector may be used in a lighted room or in a dark darkened room, depending on the nature of the specimen being looked at. For screen or direct projection, the room may need to be darker for this to be seen. Carefully, you're going to rotate the entire head of the unit into a horizontal position. Just below the hinge point, you'll be able to raise the head very smoothly. You do not have to force anything. Be sure the mirror is out of the way of the light beam coming straight through the stage and going to the screen or wall on which you wish to project the image. Be sure that the revolving polarizing analyzer is out of the light path and then you may rotate the revolving dustproof disc that contains your objective lens to achieve the magnification you wish. Remember to focus with the large knobs and in general the higher magnification you go the darker the room will need to be. If the user wishes to use the micro trip projector as a traditional microscope and no projection just remember that you will need to have the head in the horizontal position and then the viewer may view through the eyepiece on the bottom of the head. Finally, if you keep the microprojector in the horizontal projection stage, but you would like to view it on a whiteboard, you will have to use the mirror in this case. The most common reason for using it in this position is for wet specimens such as depression slides with pond water or any specimen where water or oil would flow off the slide because the unit is in the horizontal position. So you will do the exact same you have done. The only thing that you would change is you are going to actually have to position the mirror underneath the light source until you are seeing that reflection on your whiteboard. You then have the option, of course, to change your magnifications and focus on that specimen.